The goal of the uh, presentation on uh, hypersonic uh, vitrectomy was to introduce a new technology, uh, a new prototype of a vitrector that moves away from the uh, technology we are currently using, which is based on a guillotine, which aspirates and cuts the vitreous prior to removing it from inside the eye. The technology I presented is based on a, the forwards and backwards movement of the tip at 1.5 million times per minute and this induces liquefaction of the collagen fibers in the vitreous prior to them being aspirated. This technology will hopefully assist us vitreoretinal surgeons during pars plana vitrectomy surgery. Uh, this is a very common uh, type of surgery. We do vitrectomies on a daily basis for the treatment, for example, of retinal detachments, macular holes, or uh, complications from uh, diabetes mellitus. We hope that uh, hypersonic uh, vitrectomy technology, which I'm uh, developing with Pausch uh, & Lom, is going to be commercially available sometime uh, uh, next uh, year. We've done uh, animal studies uh, so far, uh, cadaveric and live uh, animal studies, uh, and uh, we are now waiting approvals for the first uh, human trials, and then we'll move on to larger multicenter trials. We hope that it will be widely ad adopted at some point, but like all technologies, I'm sure we're going to have the early adopters and the late adopters, and uh, those early adopters will uh, start looking at the technology, seeing how the technology helps them, and perhaps developing new surgical techniques.